Hey, what's going on guys, it's Sam. And in this video today, is just an update really. I've had these fish for about five days now. And yeah, just testing my water out. And to be fair, it's all looking good. The ammonia is zero. Nitrites is zero. And nitrates has a, like a little bit of pink in it, so I'll put it as a two. And I'm, yeah, I'm happy with the results. I was, I was scared I was gonna get like a big nitrate spike or something, but yeah, to see fair, I'm happy with the results. I see fish really healthy swimming about, having a good time. They sleep in the corner here at night. So I'm guessing that's why there's a, it's not like, it's not like they dig or I don't know what they do. But yeah, swimming about really healthy. And yeah, I was to feed them today as well, actually. So as you can see, I've got a bottle I got this from my local fish store actually, what well, the technique. I put four frozen cubes of brine shrimp, the like brine shrimp and garlic ones, and uh, yeah, literally shake it in, put salt water in there, stir it about, wait for the cube to dissolve, keep it in the fridge. And yeah, the fish absolutely love it. It's, it's a lot better than, uh, let's see, look, look. <laughs> look they go, mental for it. So yeah, it's a lot better than that putting a cube in there or a quarter of a cube because the cube just goes straight into that bit over there and just gets stuck. Whereas this, I can put it in the bottom. Do you want to squeeze it now? He's going after it. There you go. And I feed, I, I want to feed them twice a day. I do feed them twice a day. A lot of people say do it once a day. I mean, some people don't feed them once every three days, so... So I don't want to give them too much, but just a little bit where they can enjoy it. That's enough. They can wait. Yeah, it's not really much mess either. They do actually eat it all, which is good. Yeah, love it. And that's with the garlic. Apparently the garlic's really good for these fish. That's what my local fish store said, and to be honest, I'll just go over, he said, go over, he says. I didn't realise here, you can actually see the brine shrimp's eyes. There you go, hold it normally. Yeah, you can see the brine shrimp's eyes when you in it, which, uh, yeah, you can't really see when it's in a frozen cube. But yeah, fish, everything's all good. We'll see if few people know, but yeah, fil filter floss, bio blocks, carbon, in this chamber here, it's just an ATO. But yeah, everything's really good, it's going very well so far. No algae blooms, no ugly phase at the minute. It's been about 40 days now since this tank has been set up. So yeah, not, nothing yet. I don't know, it's, it might come soon. I keep my lighting schedule low. Well, don't keep it on as a lot. Keep the, keep the intensity quite low. Obviously, it's quite high for the video. Well, it's now. But yeah, if anyone can, yeah, tell me, if anyone's got a Kessel 80, 80, let me know the lighting schedule. And hopefully within the next month, or hopefully a couple of weeks actually, maybe get some coral, some like beginner's coral, uh, clean up crew in about two months, a month. But yeah, these fish need a, need a few friends and some corals. <laughs> so yeah, I'll, Definitely be adding them soon. But yeah, thank you guys for watching. Please uh, comment, rate, subscribe. We'll see more videos of this coming soon. And hopefully, yeah, some next video will be adding some new coral or maybe a new fish. We will see. Yeah, thank you guys for watching and uh, see you in the next video. Bye.